Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I have a Shop Disney haul and this one is slightly different to ones that I usually do. I usually have like Hollister hauls or makeup hauls and this time I decided to put an order into Shop Disney and I'm so excited to show you everything that I have because I usually go to the Disney store whenever I go to Birmingham and obviously because of the pandemic I haven't been to the Disney store in such a long time and on Shop Disney sometimes there are some really good things but you really have to keep your eye out for them and sometimes they sell out very very quickly. At Christmas I tend to get quite a few things as well and I saw a few things that I really like. I got a gift, I got clothing, accessories and then I also got another little homewares item as well that I'm so excited to show you. This is a complete unboxing. I basically had two boxes but I took everything from the second box, put it into one box just so it's easier for me to store and just so I can go through everything but I haven't opened anything out and I haven't tried anything on so hopefully they're good and hopefully they actually fit me. So if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and also make sure you hit the bell icon just so you're notified every time I upload a new video. So everything I have in this haul is in this massive box that I'm going to try and bring up for you. It is huge. It won't fit in the camera, but this is the big box I have. So it's absolutely massive and it's Disney Store, Shop Disney. So yeah, this is what I have everything in and it's literally full up and it's so heavy as well and yeah I'm gonna go ahead show you everything I got and unbox it and if you want to see everything I got then just keep watching. So the first thing that I'm going to show you is a gift and this is actually for my dad for Father's Day and he doesn't watch my videos so he will not even see this. I did show it to my mum before I got it and she was like yes you need to get it, he's gonna love it. And this is what I got. So it's a little water bottle of the child from The Mandalorian and I just thought this was so cute. My dad absolutely loves Star Wars, it's his favourite movies he hasn't seen a tv show yet but i also bought him a teddy of this for christmas and he loved it so this is a water bottle and we do tend to go to florida a lot of the time and go to disney world and i thought this would be a really good thing for him to take with him so it is just a water bottle that's all round and my dad can also wear it around disney world and you do have a strap on there so you can wear it cross body or over the neck or however you want to and this bit is my favorite bit when i got it i was like yes i love it so all you do you just pull up the head and it flips up. So that is where you drink from. When I showed it to my mum, she was like, he's gonna love that. And I really hope so because when it's Father's Day and when it's his birthday and Christmas, I don't really know what to get him other than something to do with Star Wars. And I thought, he hasn't seen this before. So I decided to go ahead and get it. It does retail for 12 pounds, but I did have a coupon. So I ended up getting it for 10 pounds 80. So really affordable and a great present. I also purchased a homeware item and I saw this on the website on the new section and I thought that is so cute and I really need to get it and it is going to replace some of my other things that I have because I have similar things but this I just thought was really good and it was a great price as well. This one is going to be a full unboxing. I don't know if it's arrived broken, if it's arrived safely so if it's broken I'll be opening it on camera and you'll see my disappointment in my face but hopefully it's arrived well. So what I got is in here, it's in polystyrene, which hopefully means it hasn't broken. I don't know if I have, oh, I don't have any scissors with me, but I do have a screwdriver. So let's take off this sellotape and hopefully it's looking good. Oh, it's fine. It's not broken. It's arrived good. <gasps> this is actually cuter in person than it is on the website. Oh my God, I love it. So this is the homeware item that I got and it's a trinket dish and it does say on it that it's trinket dish bibelot at the bottom. So it's from Cinderella, you've got Gus and you've got the other mouse and it's just, I love this. And they're in a teacup as well, it's just so cute. On the website I thought this was really pretty and then in person I'm loving it. So this is actually going to replace my other trinket dishes, I do have two. But I thought, you know what, I have this on my side because... Oh, that is so pretty. I'm just so happy with the way that it looks. It does feel really sturdy as well. So the bottom bit does feel plastic. I think the bottom bit's plastic and I think the top bit may be ceramic because this does feel a little bit more sturdy. But look at that. It does retail for £15 with the coupon I had. It was £13.50. And when you think of how good quality this is, this would be a perfect present for anyone that loves Disney or anyone that loves Cinderella. The next item that I have is a clothing item. And I don't really get a lot of clothes from Shop Disney. I tend to get them from Primark. And the things that I do have from Shop Disney are very good quality. I have a jumper that I got from Disneyland Paris. And I think I have something else in Gavin T-shirt, but I can't remember. But I love all of the quality of everything from Disney Store and from Shop Disney. So I thought I'd go ahead and pick this up. I did see this on the website and I think it's pretty much sold out in almost every single size. I did look yesterday and it was only available in one size but it's one of those where 
I love it. I'll put it on my Instagram stories and ask you guys if I was too young to get it. And pretty much everyone said, go ahead and get it. I think there was one person, but they did message me and say that they didn't actually mean to put on there because I thought it meant, yes, get it. So yeah, I decided I was gonna go ahead and get it. And I haven't tried this on. So if this doesn't fit me, then I'm gonna be really sad. But they did say on the reviews that it does come up a little bit smaller. And with my waist, I am a size six to eight. So I thought I'd go ahead and get a small because if it does come up a bit smaller, then it is likely to fit me. And this is what I got. And it's a Mickey Mouse mini skirt. It has loads of Mickeys all around it. I haven't taken it out of the packaging. So I haven't tried it on to see if it actually fits, but fingers crossed it does. So I'm just gonna take this out of here so you can see exactly what it looks like and the design and everything like that. So it feels like really nice quality as well. It's not too thick, it's not too thin. It'd be perfect for spring and summer. And it did also get a size small and I did check that the size was correct when I got it because I knew that if it was the wrong size I'd have to send them a message and say can you send me a different size but it is the correct size it's a small and on the back it has a Mickey True Original right here so you can see that it is definitely from the Disney store and the day after I purchased this I didn't have a small anymore but then the day after that they did have a small so I'd say keep checking back every single day because it seems to be that they're getting new stock in every day it actually reminds me of like 90s things. I remember when I was younger, me and my sister, we had these cycling shorts and they were both Mickey Mouse ones and mine were fluorescent pink and my sister's were fluorescent green and had Mickey faces everywhere. So this skirt actually reminds me of those cycling shorts that we had. And it was weird because when I saw my sister yesterday working, she was wearing cycling shorts, just black ones. And I was like, this really reminds me of the 90s. This is what it looks like. I just feel like it's so cute and it looks like it's not too short and it's not too long. It looks like the perfect length. So I'm so excited to start wearing this during spring and summer because now it is starting to get a little bit warmer here in England so fingers crossed we're getting our spring and hopefully I can wear this very soon and the last things that I got are some bags now did I need new handbags no I didn't did I go on the website and see that they had some nice handbags yes did I purchase those bags yes I did so I did put this on my Instagram and asked you guys which one I should buy and pretty much it was 50 50 and I just decided you know what I'm gonna go ahead and get both of them. And these are both 30 pounds and under. So it is really affordable when you think of Disney store, especially with the quality of the bags as well. I've never purchased a handbag from them before, but I did fill one of these bags and it feels amazing. The quality is so thick. And when you think that it's 30 pounds and under, that's absolutely amazing. I've actually had more expensive bags from like River Island and even designer handbags and they haven't felt as good quality as this, which is crazy when you think how cheap that the Disney store are actually sending them. Now I do know that with some people, 30 pounds is a lot of money, but I wouldn't recommend these if I didn't feel like the quality was good. But honestly, the quality is amazing of the first bag that I'm gonna show you. So the first bag that I have is a tote bag and I saw this and it was a limited edition collection and I thought this was so cute and I decided I was gonna go ahead and get my hands on it and this is what I got. So it's just a tote bag and this is so much bigger than I thought it would be. I actually thought it'd come to about here, so smaller than it actually is. But honestly, this just looks so cute. I did try this one on. I didn't try the other one on, but I tried this one on and I saw it in the mirror and I was like, this is such a beautiful bag. As you can see, I haven't worn it out because I do still have the little things on here because I wanted it to be in a box and show you guys what I got. You do also have a pocket on the front here and the quality, like I said, is so thick. The quality of this, the stitching is amazing. I do like the fact that you have this little tag on here as well, which is Lady in a Trump. And this is all old movies that they have on here. So it's all the old movie posters you have lady in a trump bambi dumbo aristocats the only thing that's missing from it is peter pan i love peter pan it's one of my favorite childhood movies but this just it's so pretty and like i said the quality is absolutely amazing and this feels really nice and thick as well and this is what it looks like on the inside so it's a beige lining and it is all fabric and you do have a pretty big pocket right here and then you have three smaller pockets at the top here so it's waterproof it feels beautiful it's very sturdy as well and I just can't wait to start using it because it's just so good and it's one of those where it's a limited edition piece and it's all of the old movies so if you do like all the classic movies then this would be a great piece for you as well and it retails for $28.95 I got it for $26.05 so £26 for this tote bag which is amazing quality honestly you guys really need to get your hands on it because it's so good and the last bag that I have I haven't even opened out of the wrapper this is going to be a full unboxing first impression from me and if you guys do go and shop disney and you know what some of the best selling things are you'll probably already be able to guess what this is because one of those where it did come i think maybe last year or earlier on in the year it sold out completely and then they brought it back because there was such high demand and this is the bag that i got so this one is based off of up and i love that movie i cry 
every single time I watch it, exactly the same as Coco, I cry every time I watch it, so it's fully in the bag, so I haven't tried this on, and I do really like the style of this as well, it really reminds me of my Louis Vuitton Speedy 30, I don't tend to wear my designer handbags out a lot of the time, the only one that I tend to wear a lot is my Michael Kors Jet Set Crossbody, because it's small and it's not in your face, and I don't really tend to wear my designer bags that often where I live and I just really like the style so I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and I'll show you exactly what it looks like so you don't get all of the reflecting from here and then you can also see the bag charm as well so I've taken the bag out of the packaging and this is what it looks like so this is a little charm that you get on here so it's just like all of the balloons and the house on there so it is really really cute and then you have the adventurers out they have a grape soda on there C and E as well from up and then you have up on the little thing right here and then on the back you also have Carl and Ellie with some handprints on the back and I just think this is so cute it's just such a cute little thing to pop on there I really like it I feel like that it feels really nice quality it doesn't feel like one of those bags that you know that's just gonna break it feels so nice it reminds me of leather but it's not leather because of the price of it because it is very affordable you can also wear this as a crossbody as well so you do have a little d-ring here where you can add on a strap and when you open it up you do get the strap inside it but this one is a magnetic closure so it literally just closes like that, which I feel like is a great thing because I love having magnetic closures on my bags. Just look at that. You won't ever forget to close it. And then when you open it up, you do have the strap in here as well. So it's just a white strap. And I've just taken out the paper and this lining is so cute. If you guys really like Up or if you like Disney, you'll love this. So with the outside, it's all white. And then on the inside, it's so cute it's blue it has the house it has the balloons on it i absolutely love this just the attention to detail that they've done is amazing so you have two pockets right here so you can put some little things in there and then on the other side you have a zip pocket as well so you can fit a few things in there and it's just one big hole but it's not massive where you're going to lose things and it feels like really good quality and i do like the fact that you can either have it as a handheld bag or you can put it on your arm or you can have the extra strap on there as well it's just so cute I didn't see anything about the lining on the website. It doesn't show you what the lining looks like. I just saw reviews when people were saying that the lining is pretty and I was like, hmm, I wonder what it is. And honestly, I can't really fault this bag. If you're an Up fan or if you're a Disney fan, you're going to love this. It's one of those pieces where they did bring it out, like I said, early on, then it sold out and then so many people wanted it and they brought it back and I do say definitely get your hands on it before it sells out again. They currently do have this available, so hopefully... It will still be available by the time this video goes up. So that's everything I got from Shop Disney or the Disney Store. Everything I have in this haul will be down below. So you can search if you do want to pick it up. And if you've purchased anything recently that you love, just comment down below to let me know. And make sure that you give this video a very big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in my next video, guys. Bye!